You're lonesome's new tootsie, huh? Lonesome. It's a hot one. I hope you have better luck keeping them lonesome than I did. Uh, I think you should understand that I'm just a business associate of Mr. Rhodes. Ain't you the whole box stop, though? The floor manager of your program is my brother-in-law's first cousin. He told me where I could find you. So you come off it, little lady. You mind if I do? I'm through with it. I must say, I think Mr. Rhodes might have done me the courtesy of telling me himself. Oh, Mr. Rhodes don't do no courtesies to nobody. I could write a book about him. Is that the purpose of your visit, to collect some more material? Oh, I came to collect. But it ain't material. Unless you get Larry to pay me three grand a month, not only will I not divorce him, but I will make it plenty hot for the both of you. I already got some feelers from Confidential Magazine. I'm not engaged to your husband. Ah, Larry, he thinks he has to take a bite out of every broad he comes across. Then he calls him a tramp, and he drops him, and it's all sort of psycho something or other, you know? I caught him red-handed with my best girlfriend. He broke my jaw. <laughs> Seems to be working quite effectively now.